you know, you come to St. Augustine for a, uh, a summer vacation. Uh, the beaches are, are nice and clean. Uh, you bring your family out and you're uh, going to the old jail, you're going to the fort, you're going to all the other uh, historical sites that are here in beautiful St. Augustine. But St. Augustine was a, a very, very different place uh, 50 years ago. It's a night and day, so to speak. Being black and poor, you have a lot of dreams and things that you want to do. They said separate but equal, but it was never equal. And that's why I joined the Civil Rights Movement. I had been threatened and everything like that. I had the Ku Klux Klan to call my house and threaten to blow it up. It was frightening. A lot of black people were afraid to go out at night. They would go around throwing Molotov cocktails and marching through neighborhoods and do all kinds of things to scare them. It was degrading to have to live like that. I think if every generation would do something for the generation behind them, the world would be a better place because we could help each other. St. Augustine today is, is, is quite different. The strength in the city comes from the people. The Freedom Trail is a tour, a trail of different markers of the civil rights movement here in St. Augustine. Northrop Grumman has been a great part of telling that story. St. Augustine is a town with history. It's a history to be told. This was such a great story because it wasn't just African American history, it was simply American history. My house is on the Freedom Trail because they asked me if I would house Dr. King. When he would come to St. Augustine, they never let him stay in one place so people couldn't find him. So I told him, yes, I would house him. He was our Moses. When I see the Northrop Grumman logo as the only logo on these plaques, I have a sense of pride. It's important that we maintain these monuments so that the story isn't lost. The North Grumman took an interest in the Freedom Trail back in 2003. Not just uh, putting their names on the sign, they actually put boots on the ground to help maintain these signs and properties to help the community uh, learn more about their history. People need to know what Northrop Grumman is about more than a company. They have a heart. Every Freedom Trail marker has a significant story. We're trying to make sure that all of the leaders, people that actually helped them as a group, will also be remembered. It just shows the commitment that Northrop Grumman has to its community and how it was not afraid to step up when others in the community did not. That is true ingenuity. You don't hear too many companies uh, that do the things that Northrop Grumman actually does relating to their employees. Northrop Grumman is not just a corporation, it's part of a community. <laughs>